We all remember what happened. A powerful winter storm buried the Metrodome just a few months ago. Now, more than three months later, work on a new roof is set to begin. Five Eyewitness News reporter Chris Keating is live at the Dome with the latest. Good, good morning, Chris. Well, Rebecca, right now I'm standing in the press box of the Metrodome, and from where I am, you've got a great view of exactly what's going on here. This is the field behind me. The first thing you'll see is the turf is covered in plywood. If you look down what would be the third baseline, those are the fabric panels we've been talking about. Those are the panels that make up this roof. And then if you look towards the center of the field, you'll see boom cranes. Already, iron workers who are up there on the roof right now have taken down one panel. They're working to take down a second panel. After that, they'll start putting up up brand new panels and once they do that it'll be a very tedious and tenuous process because they'll take that fabric actually stretch it as you would a sheet across a mattress and then bolt it into place they tell us that it is a long process however they think they'll have it done by august 1st before the vikings are ready to play football again at 10:20 this morning, the first panel came down. The fabric panel weighs about 500 pounds and is 40 feet long. One of the new panels which arrived yesterday will now be put in place by these iron workers on scene here at the Metrodome. In all, there are 106 panels that make up the Metrodome roof, and we're told the center portion about 64 panels should be done by early May. Director of Facilities Steve Mackey explained to us how this will be done. We're going to start in the middle, the center diamonds, get the initial four panels in place, and then they'll work outside of that until the center is completely done. What you're looking at right now is one of those panels that's about to come down. There is still snow up there and ice, and we've seen some snow and ice occasionally drop down to the ground below. Those are iron workers, I'm told, who are specifically selected for this work. They're familiar with this type of work. The total cost of this project is $22 million, but most of that will be covered by insurance, we're told. And there was a Vikings official here this morning. They are confident that the project will be done by August 1st. However, just in case, they are working now to get it uh, moved two of their preseason games to get on the road so there's no conflict of interest just in case there are some delays with the work here. Reporting live at the Metrodome, Chris Keating, 5 Witness News.